can feel the wind. All right, before I break it. I guess it's a dark out. I'm installing this tomorrow. Oh, I want to go test it right now. But not the On this propeller, I actually did some calculating. So first I figured out how many times per second this rotates. RPMs isn't as useful because minutes isn't useful for anything. So revolutions per second, roughly six. Uh, that's a kind of a decent like pace I could uh, I could do for a while. Now the speed I want to I want to I want to have the boat going is like 12 miles per hour, 20 kilometers per hour. That may be hoping for a lot, but I'm hoping I can do that with the motor and pedaling at the same time. So I'm designing my motor, my propeller for that. So uh, that ends up being about five and a half meters per second travel. Uh, so I've got six revolutions per second and five and a half meters per second so I'm gonna fudge the numbers a little bit and say this this has to turn once roughly every meter so I calculated the uh, circumference the, the distance this has to travel around um, for every meter and I just drew that out on a flat thing and got roughly this angle uh, and then I basically twisted this from the center out because the you know this has to travel a, a, a smaller distance around than this, so this has to be more angled into it, and this is the the shallowest angle this way, and this is the steepest. Anyway, so I actually calculated to make this propeller work efficiently at 12 miles an hour, 20 kilometers per hour. Um, so that's obviously going to be with the motor, but I want it to be most efficient at top speed with the motor. So this won't be the most efficient pedaling just on its own. Uh, the other thing is I can also bend these still to, you know, make adjustments. And if I really want to make a lot of adjustments, I can take all this apart, take the fins off, put new ones on. But I don't, I don't think I need to put new ones on unless I break them or something. Alright, oh man, it is dark and pouring rain out there. Alright, let's make a run for it.